coupled with the ongoing zombie problem does threaten to erode morale. So please, if you've had an experience with the zombie attack or if you've witnessed one of these Dracomorph bloodlettings, please don't keep it to yourself. Join one of the many support groups that we have. Or use the suggestion box. Dr. Drake, do we have a report on how the hostage crisis is going in Ward C? We do. Nurse Barbara managed to escape as soon as Dr. Goode received his martini. Both are sedated and resting comfortably. Nurse Ratney. So is Nurse Barbara still a nurse or is she just hanging out? Let's hear from Larry, the IT guy. I am not IT! I am a lab technician. I have studied for many years. How are we doing on the nebula, Larry? We think we are entering the eye of the nebula. If so, we feel strongly that Kronos our central computer could navigate us out and set a course for Rear. Uh, Yeoman Long. Re-Earth. More authentic than the original. What happens in Re-Earth stays in Re-Earth. Under penalty of martial law. Thank you, Lindsay. We are required by the centrality to say that. <clears throat> so, it looks like we're finally in the eye of the storm. Let's have three cheers for Kronos. Hip, hip! <laughs> I am the Supreme Inquisitor of the Nebula. Bow before me in humility and prepare to be judged. It doesn't seem to be a broadcast, Commander Plod. It must be communicating with us through some form of... ESP. Is there not one of you that possesses the ability to communicate your worthiness? Wait, does anyone here know ESP? No one? Since no one you can challenge my authority, I hereby send you to be eaten. Oh, come on! down to the last of the L rations. Get over it and digest us already! Don't anger it further, Buttony. Just keep your mind clear. That's easy for you to say, fathead. It was your dumb idea to disable the central computer. It was your stupid idea to go to Arbus 9. You know, you're more trouble as a drone than you were as an administrator. Really? Let me tell you the story of another fathead. Someone who became the president of Blue Zone. Why? Yes, it's a story of Why did I come back here? I knew this place would be the end of me. Me too. Although I didn't think it would be dying of boredom waiting to be digested by the supreme dickweed. Would you hurry up and do it? I miss Omicron. Sure. Omicron. He would be handy in a situation like this. Omicron? The doctor with the big purple alien on his head? Isn't he dead? 
sure the body died, but I think its name was Tom or Fred or something. Randy. The big purple alien was Omicron, the symbiote. It attaches to a normal human's head, doubles brain power, times three. I heard that's not all it enhances. I wonder why all the doctors don't have one. Uh, it is technically a parasite. I mean, it, uh, it changes your personality. Still, for an alien, he was not a bad guy. Yeah. You know, the brain symbiote's been missing since the funeral. I mean, we haven't been able to, to find it. Just gone, poof. It's curious. I mean, who would do something so bizarre as to keep a frozen space alien symbiote? And, uh, you know, like keep it for themselves. And maybe they, I don't know, sleep with it maybe, or they have it in their room, and they maybe take it along in a little case. All right! I knew it! Weirdo! Glass houses, Sneed. You keep it in your lunchbox? Oh, ick. I wouldn't expect you to understand. My affairs are my own. Double ick. You know, funny thing. I spoke to Nurse Aknar in the hallway. And he seems to think that it could be revived. this will work. I've been keeping it cold and dry under my pillow at night. Well, once it warms and fully rehydrates, it should be frisky and ready to pounce. It doesn't seem fair somehow. Oh, come on. It's not like we're killing someone. Besides, it's worth it just to have a decent gynecologist on board again. Amen. Hey, guys. What are you having for lunch? It smells good. Excuse me, I'm needed elsewhere. Yes, as am I. Coincidentally. Larry, I'm, I'm sorry to ask you this. Yes, Nurse Ratney? Please get my lunch from the rehydrator. Sure, no problem. Nice knowing ya. Good lord. What kind of diet are you on? <laughs> Tricks. Sneed, old boy. How you been? Good to see you, Omicron. Looking good there, kid. If you excuse me, I've got a hospital to save. Wow. Oh, this is gonna be good. Nurse Ripner. The centrality could use more nurses like you. I've never seen such tight hospital corners. Thank you, Doctor. I was wondering if you'd like to join me for dinner later, perhaps. No, thank you, Doctor. Nurse Rittner, wondering if you'd like to accompany me to the supply closet to engage in some consensual, sexy, rough stuff. No, thank you, Doctor. Nurse Rittner, 
Please accompany me to the supply closet for official hospital business. Certainly, Doctor. 